while I was replacing the radiator of my Dodge Ram 1500, it's 1998, which doesn't matter. Um, I figured that there is a line that comes from the transmission and there is a um, click line. So it's, it's like a line that clicks on the tube. So you have a little tube on the radiator and then you click and it snaps on there and it doesn't come off. It doesn't come out. It just comes out when you put a little tool in there which open the little um, it's like little uh, pressure plates inside and then uh, release the tube and then you can take the pipe out of there so there is a tool you can buy on Amazon I didn't use that tool but this is the tool up here and you can buy this tool for nine nine dollars I think it was on Amazon uh, but basically I, I got a toy my son had a little toy I had this extra little part um, I just cut that part and use that to unplug I'm gonna show you that and of course you can see here again the Amazon uh, the tool on, on the Amazon I didn't use that one but that that one is gonna work you can buy it if you need to don't try to force it that's not gonna force it's not gonna work don't put your screwdriver in there because it's not gonna work um, and that's it so check it out you're down here in the engine here is the radiator and this is one of the pipes I took out of the radiator this is the bottom pipe the big one you can see and this one here it's pointing up because it has transmission fluid in there see this part here you can pull this as much as you want it's not gonna work because inside here it has like some sort of clamps and down here I have another pipe of those so I took the whole thing uh, because it was dark and I want to remove it so I'm gonna get my part here I'm pretty sure this is pretty cheap but I don't want to go out and buy anything I don't want to I don't want to go out I want to do it now so you push the pipe inside get your little thing It's good if you have a piece of plastic like me that has a little lip in here and then you push it now I'm there and I just take it out done boom see and inside here let me get the camera put in there okay so this is the part how it looks right so that was the screw and this part here has this groove in there I think you can see right here right and that groove is the same one that I have on my radiator here so that pipe now can just click in here and is going to have the same effect how does that look inside look see those clips so you need to push something in there that those clips uh, move out of the way so now you're going to with one hand connect that into our radiator so I hope you enjoyed this video uh, you know everything I suffer I like to make videos and if it's not for you it's most for me because uh, it's fun for me to watch that later and you know see how I did stuff and how I learned stuff it's it's every time I get something done it's uh, something that I conquer you know so it's like a, a victory for me but anyway subscribe to my channel thanks for your support and don't forget to check out my website www.carmodsgarage.com and see you later